Okay, welcome back, cruisers. It is Saturday. January 16th, 2022. We're in Nassau, Bahamas. But it wasn't exactly a direct route to get to Nassau from Coco Cay, where we were at yesterday. We left around 1.30 and started sailing slowly. Uh, we did get a pretty good distance away from Coco Cay. There's a channel on the television that's called On the Map and you can see the current location of the ship. We were noticed about seven o'clock that we had made a U-turn and we were heading back in the direction of Coco Cay. Um, we didn't know if we were actually going back there, if we were just killing time because we were so close to Nassau already. We talked about it and you know kept an eye on it through the night and at about midnight we realized we were back at Coco Cay. Yeah. And once we got outside and started looking around, we realized that the Rhapsody was anchored just off of Coco Cay and the Harmony was docked in Coco Cay. And while we were shooting video and looking around at the Rhapsody, which we were actually rather close to, I mean, I'd say we were within a couple hundred yards at the most from the Rhapsody and we were kind of pulling around them. One of the things I want to point out is that they're all crew on the Rhapsody because that's, um, that's a quarantine ship right now. But one of the crew in one of their windows is using their cell phone like a, flashing a signal, like flashing their light on and off. It's interesting. Out of the corner of my eye, I caught a lifeboat pulling away from our ship. So we started looking around and it was lifeboat 10 was put into the water and was going over to the Rhapsody. Um, but once our ship moved around a little bit further, we could see that there was actually also two more lifeboats in the water. So we had three lifeboats in the water and they were trying to pull alongside of the Rhapsody. We watched that for a while. I think that went on for almost an hour. Then repeatedly trying to pull up to the side of the boat. You know, one would try, would pull away, and then the next one would come up and try. And I mean, we could see that it didn't look like they were unloading anything and were being successful of getting up to the boat. But like I said, after an hour, they came back and they pulled lifeboat 10 back into our ship and we immediately departed for Nassau. And here we are this morning. I went to guest services to ask about it. I understand that they're doing crew transfers and things like that, but I was just wondering why they're choosing the middle of the night. So guest services let me know that there were about 100 crew member that um, tested positive and also crew member that were not positive but that they were transferring over um, to help on the Rhapsody. And they also noted that there were approximately 180 crew member on the Rhapsody of the Seas that they were transferring off and bringing to the Allure. And they were either out of their quarantine or done helping over there. It was just interesting because he said that the transfer actually did not happen because the waters were too rough and it was too dangerous for the crew members. So they halted operations and they are going to try to have to do it on another day. They didn't know when or how or if we were gonna leave Nassau today and then go back and try to do it again um, before going back to Fort Lauderdale. He wasn't sure, but the transfer did not actually happen. So when the crew, when the captain came on this morning and said that we went back to transfer crew, that's true, but he just didn't point out that we didn't actually transfer the crew. So right. that's all, just, just minor detail. Um, but like I said, we are here in Nassau this morning and we're going to go hopefully enjoy our day here and we'll update you if we hear anything else. All right. Thank you, guys. We'll talk to you later. All right. Bye. Bye. Hi, guys. I hope you liked our video. If you did, please consider subscribing, leaving a like, and hitting the notification bell. And make sure you share this video with your friends because it helps out a ton and it keeps the algorithm happy. Bye.